Anna, the opening sequence, when there's a young, innocent girl trudging through the snow, and she's actually a trained assassin. She's capturing her first year. Um, what I love about it is the kind of ethereal quality and the innocence of this young girl, the kind of warrior and the kind of more assassin-like nature of the girl at the same time. It's just actually really thinking about the essence of the snow that's falling in that opening shot. So for me, I wanted to kind of get that in the texture of the fabrics. So finding the appropriate fabrics that it's almost like the Eskimos' hundred words for snow. Um, thinking about the hundred kind of possibilities of texture for a fabric. And so I wanted each dress or gown or I have one man's outfit to kind of capture a different possibility of that snow scene. This year's inspiration is taken from the game of chess, obviously only the white pieces. Um, it's been an interesting time to take something that is truly a classic game that everyone has played at one time or another and transform it into something that's wearable. So when you think of something like the game of chess and you think, let's say, of old school Russian chess masters and you need to update that um, and you need to make it, again, something fresh for people today to say, yeah, you know what? I never thought I wanted a white suit, but I kind of want that white suit. With Artful Gentlemen, it's really important for us to take a classic look and really spin it in a modern direction. Um, at this point, it really is about us expanding our women's uh, opportunity. Um, and that also goes into the androgyny space, looking for clothes for women who are looking for more, maybe something more on that butch femme line of things, or something a little bit of a bender in between. Fascination 
from my collection is Bonnie for Bonnie and Clyde and particularly Faye Dunaway from the 1960s film that she did. The look of the hats that she wears in some of the scenes. I have tied the hats with some of my coats and then I expanded on that with some other outfits that I'm very excited about and I hope it's going to flow beautifully with the rest of the other designers. This year is called Depth Perception. The inspiration behind that is dealing with manipulating on different fabrics and also doing different things in the collection that I probably never would do in my other collection previously that I've made. Some of the challenges I face in making this collection is keeping things fresh and new and also exciting for people to see something different from me as well as pleasing myself and being satisfied with the end result.
is called um, silver ice, and uh, because in Brazil we don't have snow, um, I was thinking of um, coming back for the first time I saw the snow and um, the snow flakes coming down, and I realized that they come in different colors and they can be in different shapes. So I, um, actually, I do love to work with um, white fabrics because um, my collection stuck with uh, white fabric and then hand painted. And for this snow, um, I needed to come with just pure white um, and uh, decided to do some exquisite design and uh, hand embroidery. My name is Joseph Domingo. I'm the founder of San Francisco Bay Area Fashion Network. It's a social network for all the designers, photographers, models, hair and makeup people. So my inspiration this year is Ice Princess. It's uh, beauty person in time. Some of the challenges I face is how to create white and come up with a pure essence of white for the snow collection. One of the goals for tonight is to have everybody have fun, enjoy, and hopefully more snow to come.
Maybe you 